Hey everyone, welcome back to another book preview video. This week we have Drawing the Female Figure, a guide for manga, hentai and comic book artists by Hikaru Hayashi. Um, apologies for my bad pronunciation. So a quick look at the cover there and a quick look at the back. So before I actually start flicking through this, I just wanted to point out there was already a version of this book. So this is the other version. I'm told there are actually other ones as well and basically it's in a different language. So my brother lives over in Taiwan and he picked this one up for me. But supposedly this is this. So this has just been released um, in English is what I'm trying to say so you don't have to translate it. So let's take a look inside. So I'm switching to a voiceover now for the rest of this video. And the reason for that is because of the nature of what's included in this book. As you can probably guess from the title, which we'll talk about in a second, I am leaving the contents on screen for a couple of seconds there. Just for those of you that want to stop, pause the video and read what's included, I will try and go back and read out what's in that contents in a second though. So yeah, the way I've done this, I've had to try and record some pages being opened, but a lot of the time you'll notice I just have to hold it on one page, fade it to the next bit of footage of another page. That's because <laughs> there's quite a lot of pages between these that are not appropriate for YouTube. YouTube does have quite strict rules when it comes to nudity. And although I know this is just art, some of it is a little bit suggestive. Again, you probably could tell that from the title of the book. So most of what I'm actually previewing on camera to start with is more um, structural anatomy, bones and some manga faces, things like that. However, you might have noticed at this point in the video, I was already running out of things to show that weren't nudity. There was always some sort of nudity or boobs on each page. So I just got a little bit of card and covered certain bits so that I could still preview this for those of you that want to see it. It did make this video a little bit of a pain to record, but I tried my best to still show you guys some of what's included. So like this one there, for example, whilst there is a lot of nudity and drawing certain features, it also includes things like drawing the feet. And I will say that the actual illustrations are quite sketchy, look like they're done with a pencil in this book, and I really like that. Also, I left this bit in just as a little bit of a joke so that you guys can see between each of the pages that I can show. This is how many I sort of had to go through before I could find a suitable page. These last five, I think, were just focusing on how to draw boobs in great detail. I figured I could get away with showing a little bit of the rear view. I also realised, as you will see in a second, that the end section of the book is how to draw faces. So a lot of this does become suitable again and appropriate. Maybe I should have started with this section. And for those of you that are interested in where I got this book, I will put links in the description box below. I think it was only like 17, 18 pounds at the time of buying this. I did pre-order it, so the price might change a bit. I'm not someone that actually draws much manga. Most of my books are not this kind of book. They're more how to draw fundamentals, Andrew Loomis, human anatomy, more realistic. But I can appreciate stylized art, so I thought I'd buy this. It's not expensive. So I think if you're looking to buy this book, you probably already know and can tell from this preview what to expect. I think the title gives you a good understanding, but I will have a quick read of the contents just to give you a breakdown. So there's about 175 pages to this book, and it starts with understanding the skeleton, bones and muscles. Somehow that skeleton still seemed to have boobs. Next is using a simplified skeleton in drawings. All of these again do have subcategories are all broken up the arms, hands, legs, etc, etc. Part three is softness and sexual allure, creating sex appeal, focusing on the breasts, which has quite a lot of pages to it. Torso, the groin, the bottom. Number four, portraying bones. And number five, drawing the face that we've just seen there, which includes things like hair and a little bit of character design. So that's it, guys. I hope you guys found this video useful if you are considering buying the book. If you are into this kind of thing or drawing, let's call them sexy female manga characters, then I think you'll find this book quite useful. If you did enjoy the video, make sure that you hit that thumbs up button. Leave me a comment below. Let me know what you're reading at the moment and be sure to subscribe for more content. Thanks for watching, everyone.